this situation when we really realized, you know, how dire it was. And because we know this is not a new problem, but that people were in a situation now where they didn't have clean drinking water. What, I, what I'm really proud of is that community leaders from all over the country, grassroots community leaders, in, on one phone call, we mobilized a team of about 12 to 15 people who said we're on our way. People lined the street outside of the Robert Smith Medical Clinic in hopes of getting water for not only themselves, but also for those who are unable to leave the house. One Jackson man says he was getting water for him and his mom. Yeah, it's been real hard on her because, like I say, she wheelchair bound and, uh, you know, it's hard for her to get around. Yeah, it's real hard on her. With so many people not able to leave their homes to go get fresh water, one Jackson leader is challenging people to help those who sometimes cannot help themselves. Also, we want to do a water challenge for the city of Jackson, Hines County. If you see a ramp in any home, please stop and leave two cases of water. So we're challenging the citizens of Jackson, Hines County. If you see a ramp in someone's home, please drop off two cases of water. Event organizers say they plan to host more water distributions in the future. And with no predicted end of Jackson's water crisis, some residents say they are concerned as we approach the fall and winter. Marie Menefield, 12 News. Well, thank you, Marie.